Hey, check it out. You've got to see this. I've got some copper and I've got some magnets. Watch what happens. Here I've got a piece of copper pipe. I've drilled some holes in it so you can see what's going on inside. A regular steel ball drops right through, like you'd expect. But a magnet drops in slow motion. It's weird. It looks fake, but there's some science magic behind it. I put the pipe in a stand so you can see better. It's interesting, copper is not magnetic, but when a magnet moves near it, it induces a magnetic field in the copper, slowing it down. Too much science for you? It just looks freaky. Plus, with my stand, I can make it fall forever. Too much fun. Here's another cool way to see this effect. I've got a block of copper and a magnet hanging on strings. Because of this magnetic breaking effect, the magnet slows down suddenly just before hitting the copper and then eases in the rest of the way. Take a look in slow motion. You can see in just one frame it goes from full speed to zero. Now most of us know that copper is not magnetic. You can't pick up a penny with a magnet, but it's known as diamagnetic. But without me hurting your brain talking about electron pools and eddy currents, I can only describe it as chewing gum. When you move the magnet near the copper, it feels like there's chewing gum in between. It's really odd. You can feel the connection only when you're moving them. You can push, you can pull, you can wiggle, but it won't stick. It just slides right off. Diamagnetic. Copper. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.